Hello, Nordic people of the Northern Hemisphere, and welcome back to another Venison Eviscerating, Oxen Boxing, and Horn Swallowing episode of God of War. <laughs> Now we left off, I was uh, following Atreus to where he found one of the Shrines of Tear, where we were suddenly attacked by a half-woman and half their hunters monster that wanted to enact revenge against all the other baby killers by raiding Skyfire with her, like, friggin' fire bow and bucking me in the face for fun if I even so dare take a peek at her meaty venison hindquarters. Now, fortunately, after multiple tries, I skewered that her tasty raw ribs with her own bow and chopped her up for a nice hot venison barbecue. Mm -mm -mm. I just hope it doesn't actually count as freaking cannibalism if I eat up a uh, half woman, half deer. Oh, by the way, the name of the half woman, half deer is known as a curvator, not a centaur. Centaur is half human, half horse. Curvator is half human, half deer. So anyway, as I was a uh, Reading through the bestiary, I found out that these uh, Curvator Huntresses are actually worshippers of a gigantic goddess named Scapey, who is a female goddess expertise on skiing, bow hunting, and mountain climbing. I also did some other research on this uh, Scapey goddess and learned that the old Norse word for that goddess, Scapey, means harm or shadowy. So in a sense, the, the hunters that we encounter was uh, just really wants to kill us. And he kind of like freaking ambushed us in a sort of shadowy, uh, sneaky kind of way, you know? In fact, the word scapey is how we actually got the English word for scape. So when people say they got away unscathed, that means they got away without any harm. Hence the term. I was kind of spoiled on the role of scapey when I learned that she would tie up Loki, aka Atreus, with the uh, friggin' like, bleeding skins of uh, poisonous serpents. As according to the 13th century uh, Nordic scholar and historian Snorri Sturluson. As for the worshippers of the Skavi, who are the Kervators, I found no references of any dear woman hybrids in Norse mythologies. The only reference I found were dear woman from Native American mythologies. These half woman and jazz half deer creatures are known to punish men who abuse women and children by luring them in, seducing them, and then suddenly stop uh, those so-called men to death with their hooves, sometimes even biting their tender lower ghibli bits as they remain alive, you know? <laughs> Very fit fitting punishment for like a domestic abuser. So anyway, as we were uh, venturing throughout the Frostlands, I also encountered a large raider boss wearing a uh, friggin' oxide skin, hence they're called like a uh, friggin' raider chiefs. And they wear these ox hides, hoping to chant that freely of spirits of strength and uh, brawn of the ox, or as the Norse people will call them, Uxi. Little did he know that, that in real life Norse mythology, the ox is actually considered a spirit animal with a tame nature. <laughs> you hear that? Oxens are actually considered tame according to the Nordic people. Okay, you know why? Because these oxen were mostly used for carrying tons of lumber, food, and other essential cargo, practically making them domestic slave carriers of heavy tasks for the common people. So if, if the friggin' Raider chief wants to shout out the inner like, top gangster or boss of Inhead, he should have chosen like the uh, skin of a wolf, a leopard, a lion, or perhaps even a deer, since they are known to buck anyone who even dares try to take a sweet bite of the juicy raw flesh. Oh, and also I found out that there's actually like a giant uh, ox in North mythology known as a uh, Afumla. Yeah. And the name uh, basically means like a uh, hornless rich cow in the uh, Norse. And apparently it's the uh, friggin' cow that fed the uh, Ymir, the, the, the uh, giant frost giant Ymir, with all of this very luscious, luscious, delicious milk, you know? And he fed the milk from that Afumla uh, so many times that he basically grew giant. And the only way this like a uh, freaking hornless rich ox, or which actually may be a, more of a, more of a cow instead of an ox, that cow has to like rely on s licking the salt from like the icy salty rocks in order to sustain herself. You know, and that's the reason why we managed to like get all the freaking gods and the goddesses and the giants and from the uh, human because Yemen basically drank a lot of milk during his early days. You know. 
Man, I didn't talk to you so much about freaking Norse mythology and stuff. I'm learning a lot about the Norse mythology, and so are you guys, you know. Because remember, this is more than a gaming channel. This is an educational channel as well. And right now, this uh, dwarf guy over here named you know, Nunes. I think it was Cinder, right? Cinder? I always keep forgetting names. This Cinder basically you know, like invited us into his luxurious, like, friggin' suite to hide the you know, Kratos and uh, Big Boy Atreus from the uh, friggin' Odin and his two peeping Tom Ravens, you yeah. know? And right now, we're gonna head to the refuge before we can plan on how we should rescue Tyr from the prison. Because it turns out, uh, Atreus found like an old story that supposedly says that uh, Tyr was actually like imprisoned inside a dwarven mine instead of like, you know, being killed by Odin as uh, told by the uh, friggin' uh, corrupt uh, god himself, you yeah. know. So right now, we're gonna head into that suite and uh, plan our next move. There's no place like a... You can see, we've oh, set here in the realm here. between realms. Oh, it's not too much, it. but it's safe from Fimble Winter. Safe from Odin's eyes. Looks serious. You really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray lights. Oh, Sindri's ass. That's it, don't call him Sindri. Intriguing. Ha <laughs> you took the words right out of my mouth, Sindri. I can see how super, well, clean you made this place. Considering your tumor full of personality. Come in. Come in. Thank you, Sidney. If you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly. Yes, yes, I would. Then take off your shoes, too. Okay. You're not going to wipe your feet, are you? Okay. Then take off your shoes, okay? The kitchen is just over there. Any Anybody need a snack? I could go for some curvature here right now. I need a snack. Well, we need lunch. We need lunch. We need lunch. We need lunch. We can try and rest the tear to tear. Uh, alive? I mean, that's... Yeah, he's still alive. What? He's in prison. It's okay. I told him everything. Oh, uh, yes, you know everything. Everything. Did really, my son disobey me? No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important <laughs> right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. You I have a lot just, It's just, there's... It's just a lot of money. And why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be <laughs> frank, there was something we needed your help. Oh, no, what happened, Sindri? Did you, like, bring drops of a very pissed off? I finally will require the services of the smartest man alive. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's Brock. So Good old Brock, dude. How'd that get in here? <laughs> He's growing. I am tall now. Oh, no. Looks like you need to wear high heels now, Brock. <laughs> you don't recognize him? I you. Now, come on, man. I can't even do so that. Many bits in place. He's just getting older, you dark trap. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey. 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 Knows what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know Hey, you're going to give me and sell me something or not. Believe me. Alright, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallop. Yeah, 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 whatever, Brock. Show me the money. Yes. Oh, yeah, so but we'll first repair my shield. Busted up good. Wait, we have to. When you're out of the way, you up a new one? It is important to me. Yeah, it's, it belongs to his uh, dead wife. Let's so. See what I can do. In the meantime, do your magic, Brock. How about I fix you up with something to get you by? Alright, let's see what you got, Brock. Welcome to the Hoodra Brothers Shop. Craft and upgrade armor, weapon attachments, and items using the resources. View different shop services using the bottom navigation bar. Brock has enough materials to forge a new shield. Navigate down to the shield's menu. Yeah. I only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. Sure thing, Brock. <laughs> Whatever you need. <laughs> and see, so we got the Dauntless Shield or the Stonewall Shield. Yeah, okay, yeah, we've only got the best defense. But what's the difference then? The Dauntless Shield. 
a shield fit for a high risk and high reward parry is. Or the stone wall shield, a shield fit for absorbing attacks and striking back. Uh, that's pretty heavy. <laughs> oh my god, I got back to the shit. Okay. Hmm, I'll use the prairie. Hmm. Yeah, you know, I worry about a lot of person, so I want the most protection for my body, so. Let's do this. Ha ha! A shield molded after the Great Wall in Ascar, built by the giant Yrimfer, protected the wells. I suck at pronouncing Norse names, uh. Uh, I'm not much of an expert on Norse mythology, but I am learning, so. Kratos' ability to block is now restored. Now it's time to go and get Atreus some new armor. Alright, Atreus, uh, you're up next. Oh, press L2 or R2 to go to the armor tab. Now, Brock will craft some custom armor to fit Atreus. Navigate downwards to the companion armor. Yeah. Oh, you have an armor, good. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, best make a hammer to swing it in for new duds. <laughs> Alright, you're a man, Brock. You're a man. Craftable equipment is indicated with the hammer icon on the list. Craft Atreus new armor now. Brothers Bad Investments, an armor crafted with care by the legendary Holden Brothers, said to be one of their finest works. Whatever you say. Ooh, looking good. Let's equip it. Let's see. Waste armor and wrist armor. Let's try your wrist armor. Wraps of survival. Thick, sturdy armor that was built to endure Fimble Winter. Good for preventing frostbite. Not very good at protecting against axe blows or sword attacks. Okay, we got Fortify Husk Arm Guard and Vidar's Braces of Might. Fortify Husk Arm, husk arm Guards. Armor built from the husk of some of the sturdiest creatures in all of the Nine Realms. It provides the wearer maximum coverage, increasing their defense. Or, Vidar's Brace is his bracers of mind. Armor that allows the wearer additional movement around the joints. Its construction allows the user to swing their weapon with more force, increasing their strength. You know what? I think I'll go with this one. I mean, it's not as you know, hard as the Bracers, bracers of mine, but I do kind of need a little bit uh, more advantage on the uh, strength here, so. Alright, got you did it. Ooh. Oh, I can upgrade this actor, actually. But is it worth it, though? Hmm. Yeah, you know, let's do it. Uh, just, just one more, just, just one. Spit time! <laughs> Uh, waist armor. We got the fortified girdle and VR's belt of might. Okay, uh, yeah, this is too low. Uh, let's try this girdle over here. Ooh. Looking good, Kratos. Okay, I think that's enough. I'm ready to go on silver now, so. Okay, is there any way I can like, sell any of these items? Oh, yeah, that's sell. Okay, not that, not that one now. No. And, and not, not yet. But let's check the weapons. <laughs> Looks like Thimble Winner's been hard on her girl. Uh huh. Yeah. Get her here. She's overdue for some rock love. Hey, <laughs> be gentle with her, okay? <laughs> she doesn't like it too rough, alright? Give her a warm, nice touch of feeling. Frozen Flame. Ooh. <laughs> Look at that. Upgrade on the fight and act successful. Stat and damage now increased. Yeah, I think I'll be enough for this. Come attack L1 to shield slam. Launching enemies when fully charged. Block attacks to absorb it and build up charge. Guard break yellow ray attacks can now be blocked when not fully charged. Oh, yes, finally. Uh, this is my best investment yet. Do we work? Well, some items you left behind, tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? That's problem. I'm gonna go look around. Check out my room. Shops I'll have when you're ready. Oh man, I didn't read in time. Shops have a chest filled with lost items you may have left behind after a rigorous battle encounter. Oh bro, finally, here's the codex. 
Brock. A dwarf in Blacksmith Brock was the first ally we encountered when we set out for Mountain's Peak. He and his brother Sindri made a Leviathan ask for Fae, and this has been our common bond. Brock is blunt, with foul talk, but there is wisdom in his bluster. I found him an acceptable company. <laughs> yeah, of course, he did. Reminds me of you, back in your old days, huh? This place is great, Sindri. You built it all yourself. You know it. Ha <laughs> ha! Good old Sindri. Let's see what you got here. Treating everyone's favorite as your Bulgarian. <laughs> the book you call me. He means you're a swear word, man. <laughs> Exquisite. Learn to read a dictionary, Brock. <laughs> Wait, did even have to? Nah, nah, I don't think so. No. At least read something, Brock, okay? Read something. <laughs> Expand on your vocabulary. <laughs> Ooh, Wait, every kind those of stairs will not support you. Please don't break my house. <laughs> You should have thought about that before you invite us in, Sindri. <laughs> anyway, let's see. We got a wicker basket and chair. Nice bed. Mm, that's, that's a nice dipster, Sindri. You can see why you chose this good place as your uh, go to uh, cash hideout. See? I knew you were. <laughs> yes, I knew. <laughs> yes, you. Come on, Kratos, admit it. You are feeling pretty hungry and pretty pettish after that fighting. You still brought that, uh, Curvator venison with you, right? No? Okay, fine, you can have it for yourself. You need more than those than I do, so... Mmm, that's nice. Goat sausages. Or... Lucanita. Is that... No, 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 that's... No, that's just the same room again. Uh, hey, come see. What is it, Atreus? I guess this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. Hmm. Yes, you can make yourself a very nice piece of simple breakfast right in your bed, you know? Bed and breakfast. Just gotta wish we had, like, some sort of maid around here. Maybe you can crack yourself one of those, like, uh, those golems to do, do some housework for you while you, like, uh, do your blacksmithing and stuff. Anyway, uh, let's... Finding everything all right, I hope? Let's see what Sindri's up to. Hmm. We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring a head. Oh, yes, sir. Uh, me either. So, what exactly is Tyr being held? He's imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Okay, let's learn about Sindri first, before we, uh, have a story. On our journey to Jotunheim, Sindri proved himself a capable blacksmith and valuable ally. Now he has been helping Atreus in the search for Tyr. I am unhappy this was done without my knowledge. Though it is better that Atreus was not alone in his path. I will uh, attempt to spare the dwarf my wrath. It may not be easy. <laughs> Come on. You do. Full of minds to realize. You'll need help narrowing me down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Durlin? Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours. Sort of. My dwarf? He's a city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information. Oh, he's an archivist, okay. And I know, he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Oh! Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? A god a rebellion. rebellion. A rebel leader from New Mall. Sounds like exactly what we need. Hmm, Reminds me of Sylvester's division. Ta da! I, 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 I heard you tell. I heard you ta da, Sindri. I heard you ta da. I was Meet interrupted. You the gateway outside. Uh, rebel leader? Durlin? <laughs> that ain't giving a hand a haircut. Huh? Hey. Here, you just remember things however they pop into your pain, don't you? I suppose you think Durlin just count the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. <laughs> what do you mean, bro? Will you help us or not? No, never mind. Uh, it ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. <laughs> Fine. Go darken Derwin's door. Bye, baby. Hey, well. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. Maybe not friendly to you, Brock. Don't get out. And he talk funny, too. 
Yeah, just screams. Too studying contrast. <laughs> Let's talk some more, Brock. I've always wanted to see your home run. This photo finds sounds unique. It's so dark, my dad. Stupid ace here, man. You got better names. You look like dark elves to you. Uh, uh, you call the realm something else. Neither of them which is also the name of the capital city and where you should look for Oh, need ne 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 so full of Odin fuckers now. <laughs> it ain't hardly somewhere a self-respecting dwarf would show his face. Harsh, but accurate. Anyway. Oh, the stairs, I was gonna stay. Yeah, I definitely was definitely crushing the pot. Maybe like invest in a, in a, one of those uh, lead chair lists, right? I, I just like a pulley list for the like, cradles over here, okay? I, I, I'm sorry, I, I'm, not, uh, I'm not talking much about, uh, the, about what's going around here, guys. Uh, like I said, this is the only uh, God of War game I'm playing here, so let's just uh, head out right now and get on with uh, meeting up with the other dwarf. You hear that? I hear nothing, uh, Atreus. Are those some kind of dragons? Dragons! They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. Yeah, maybe it's best if you just uh, leave them alone. They seem to be want to enjoy their feast and quiet. Don't, don't leave off the uh, rigged edge, okay? Alright there, uh, let's search around here. We'll just need to buy frost in the hand. Brock, do the touching. Oh, this would be the plot requiring my assistance. <laughs> you said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. Oh! I have to get a better look at the problem with those bifrost eyes of yours. So, I, do I control this thing? So <laughs> <laughs> he got him off on a wheelchair! No, 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 this is just Hold you in place while we shine this light in the Oh, the projector. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Laser eyes are trained. But now, I was really hoping not to do the eye with the clamps. I didn't Go into the light. Oh, laser eyes, baby. Woo woo. That's our cue. Come on, let's go, 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 go. Knock on wood. It's mine. What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just there. Just hit it, Ash. Press the changer. Oh. Oh, pa. Yeah. I'll show you how much damage we fuck. Just, yeah, yeah, where he is. Here's your taser joke, you old goat. <laughs> I must admit, that was actually pretty funny. <laughs> Ricky, you're actually, you basically did laser eye surgery. You got freaking paper. <laughs> Give him some temporary laser eyes. Or, or crepuscular red eyes, if you're one of you born. Father. Yeah, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The blood frost is broken. Oh, no. Now that we reconfigured these gateways to use Idrisil seeds, oh. you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. Hmm. I also used it for light. Okay. Good note. I'll figure something out, but first, come on, let me show you how it works. All right, then. Show us the way, Cinder. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Aim your key at the room for Sparrowfine on the right. And concentrate. Concentrate. Okay, so far the high. Well available to travel. Press X to open the map. <laughs> you track to the siege one, thirty one. Retrieve me, Miranda. Travel to Savartan High. You track to the realm seeds. Unlike access to new mystic gateways. Shine the light on the Egressel on Savartaheim. Alright, let's see. There we go. Mr. Gateway, I'm going to press X while hovering over the wetlands, Mr. Gateway, to travel to Savartaheim. Oh, no, no, hold X to do it, okay? Uh, I always had to hold buttons. This should take oh, you to the outside Nidavalir City. Just uh, make your way to the town square and ask for Derwin at the tavern. You don't know him at the tavern? 
Jarlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. <laughs> I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Do you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. Moist. The river everywhere. Hostile, slimy, cop smoke. Yeah, of course you're being a jerk, though. Wait, what? Well, I said good luck! <laughs> Exactly. Dude, Dude, the Unity's don't let us jump off, right? Unity's yeah. crossing our man by us. Right, brother? Yeah, I know, I know. Of course I remember. <laughs> you took your words right out of my Yeah. No, I, I just want to enjoy the deal, okay? I just want to enjoy the deal, right? Uh, okay, that's enough sightseeing for today. There's no place like that. Oh, look at the quest for tears for starting. Whoa, do you feel that? What's mm. that like? Anything. Everything. It's warm. Yeah, it's not winter anymore. Yeah! Oh, that's worse. Ah, finally, away from that brindle winter. Yeah. I mean, I don't mind the cold a lot. Ah, uh, I'm not used to it. If I can just get it free. Yeah, we're gonna boat ride again and tell stories just like the last game. Reverse Newt. Ooh, look at the bird. Careful, lad. Yeah, I got it. It's... Uh, oh, oh, I changed what happened. Ah, right, 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 right. So Whoa, what the heck? Wretched. Wretched. <laughs> what the heck do you look like for <laughs> giant and paradoxical frog tadpoles? Wretched. Oh, oh, I jump at the jet that smashes them up like that's about well named her. The stench should give off rivals a troll's botch. And then some. On your own, they may seem like an easy foe, but rarely are they seen without companions. A pack of wretches will quickly overwhelm even the strongest of enemies. Wretches thrive in the wetlands, find anybody in water, and they'll likely be nearby, basking in mud and filth, not doing any favors to their already a unique state. You'll need to be quick on your feet during an encounter with a wretch of any kind. And I'd also watch the team. Miss and you're all.
Just like old times. So, got any good stories for us, Neymar? Yeah. Hmm, right. I'll take that. Yeah, let's see. Now, which way should I go? Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, I suppose we can go uh, left over here and see if there's any more resources. Ooh, let's in the barrel. Ooh, that's over there. <laughs> but I don't have to sit out here. Okay, I'm getting glad to sit out here. Oh, okay, yeah, here we go. Oh, uh, yeah. Ooh, Cheshire. Find all three seals here. 
So the app is gone. But where's the, oh, and the bee's over here. Ah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, I can't chop through an axe today. Where's the R then? I gotta be more observant. Yeah, this right is even my aim here. Let me see the big one. In here. Nope, not in here. Yeah, maybe I just go over here first. Maybe we get a better reverse eye view about where the other room is. She was a friend to the giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. Hmm. If he was a part of the rebellion here. I certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Well, you know what I say. The enemy is my enemy, he's my friend. Yeah. Okay, let's go find the R room. Come on. There's got to be a faster way to get down there. I just going to keep throwing around until I'm going to struck at ruin. The room is over here. Okay, I guess we'll come back later. Oh, you know what this means? Zip! <laughs> Woo! Yeah! I don't know. 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 I Oh, that's it. Oh. I love this! Who is it? The great? Time to rock out, baby! Woohoo! Oh, that's it, bro! Oh, that's it! Gee! Oh, that's it! Oh, that's it! Right here, baby! Woohoo! Stone Ball. Hold L1 to absorb standard and guard break yellowing attacks. Okay, that's nice again. Go! 
Species for lack of a better word, violent taxi teenager. In your puberty phase. <laughs> Among the most mobile denizens of the nine rattles, the Grim can climb almost any surface and barrel into the ground at disconcerting speeds, making them all too easy to lose sight of. Fortunately, they haven't developed the ability to fly. Yet! <laughs> Wait, they fly as a dog? Oh, no. Right, of course, we, uh, go find a way to break, break the wheel. Yeah, where are you? Uh-huh. Oh, that's a good idea. Hmm. Woo, treasure. Right there. Yeah, it's gonna climb up here. <clears throat> and see what we got. Ooh. I'll take that. Alright, let's uh, head to the 
guys there. Hey, there's gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. Hmm. Whoa! He's about to suddenly end up snag deep in cheek the ground. Was that an earthquake? I don't think so. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spotlight. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Yeah, man. Think you can reach the wheel from here? I just hope they didn't wake up something dangerous during their mining operations. Ah, let's see what we got. Ooh, more hat filler. Alright, uh, we need the, the chains. Yep, I'm going to uh, turn this now. Ah, yeah, yeah. Alright, that's a lot of moving. Oh, wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. You're welcome. Yeah. Hmm. Still haven't done that hard. so warm. Maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but hmm. maybe it's just different in Spotify? I lie. Thimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Yeah, it's too hot for winter. That Thimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. Yeah, Thimble it just means harsh. Does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. <laughs> and I'm not telling you it's from me. Observe the aforementioned aroma. <laughs> present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. There you are. Oh, I see. Hey, yeah. Okay, there we go. That should do it. Aha! Looks to be an artifact. Ooh! resistance. Shiny. Great Mars Brassum. Brassum. A few dwarves you may be well familiar with. Things left behind. Rydemar's Brassum. Rydemar is known for two things. Firstly, he was one of the great armorers of Zivartarhaf Vine. Secondly, his sons are all dragons. That's right. Rydemar fathered the dragons you know as Reagan, Fafnir, Oh my god. You call an armorer freaking dragon? You beastly beast, Hermano, uh, Rydemar. Wasn't a terribly good fodder, by measure, unless you directly rate one's paternal ability to your fire your sons can breathe anyway, and the fire is packs, if you know what I mean. But Diane Levy could have made a good set of flight mail. <laughs> Odin wanted him to design the I need mean, her heart's armors. Rydemar obliged. But, but, of course, I mean, those are fatal flies in the armor that could cause a breastplate to snap like a stale bread from a slightest blow. About a dozen Einharar died before the all father realized what had happened. They caught Harajar trying to escape from a round travel gate. You can imagine what happened next. Uh, yeah, basically, he cheated Odin in all his, like, prized money for this very cheap-ass armor. Aha, this is really Better in his hands than out in the open. There's the arm ruin. There we go. Roller check unlocked. Rest in peace, you stuck in the funneling scully wag you. <laughs> yeah. Let's see what's in the northern chest. There you go. Ooh, heads of gold. An apple. Eat for the apple. Eat, eat for the apple. Cut enough eat for the apples. Maximum health increase. Woohoo! Yum, 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 yum. Delicioso. Okay, let's get back to the boat. Ah, we got fun with this place already. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't press, I didn't press, I didn't press, I didn't press square by accident. Ah, yep. Yep. Alright, uh, let's uh, get back to rowing. You know what to do, Trace. Alright, let's see if there's any more uh, treasures that I haven't uh, explored yet. Oh, there's no fish living in a sulfur lake. I think they don't taste pretty good, <laughs> considering the <you know. laughs> uh, Forget obnoxious contents in the uh, steamy, yeah, dangerous uh, river here. 
We have over here. Think we can fit under that bridge? Yeah, just lie down. Oh, look at me, you're in limbo. <laughs> Easy peasy. Uh, let's see. What else is new? Ooh, what is that? It's a life blood drop. Ah, he just has dual of Rudy Power. A trip from the dual of the World Tree brings lasting benefits. Rudy Purdy now increased by two. Woohoo! Yeah, that's a nice little uh, water wheel. We got a water wheel here. And, oh, that must be a sluice gate. But we need to finally lift this up uh, somehow. But first, let's go. Oh no, more grain. Okay. 
Yeah, even with the jump gate, I'm gonna still get my butt kicked. And I'm gonna use the close combat. And that is again. Whoa! Wow. Go! Wow, wow. Okay, just to keep dodging. <laughs> I need to upgrade my armor. Maybe uh, Frost is not a good idea. Let's just use the uh, fire instead. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't mind you burning out a timer because I'm just trying to do it again. Stay a little bit longer here. Uh, at least I feel like I can get all these quick people all these ways. Hey, what do I do? Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. It's a terrible idea. I am not doing too hot. I'm out of fluids. Yep. Yes. 
Get two codes in person. Uh oh. Shield will activate. Uh oh. Pow! Whoop up. Yeah, 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 I got this. Take a bow! I'm going to stop playing this when I can defeat all of the green people here, so. Bear with me, guys. Get Uh oh. Until next time. So long.